Hey guys, it's Layla. Today we will speak about the mediastinum. There are two areas. You have the superior and the inferior. The mediastinum is divided by a horizontal plane from the sternal angle to the lower border of T4. Above this plane lies the superior mediastinum and below it the inferior, which consists of the anterior, middle and the posterior mediastinum the heart in mind so in front of the heart would be the anterior the heart itself is within the middle mediastinum behind the heart would be posterior and above it would be superior let's speak about each of them in turns so I want you to remember bands so we have V which is for vein we have A for artery and N for nerve you need to remember that the superior mediastinum has 11 bands in total the middle has five and the posterior has four starting with the superior so with the vans you have four arteries you have the arch of the aorta you've got the brachiocephalic artery you've got the left com common carotid and the left subclavian arteries then you have four nerves you have the right and left vagus the right and left phrenic then you have three veins, right and left brachiocephalic and the superior vena cava. Other contents, apart from the vans, you've got two tubes, which is the trachea and the esophagus. You have one gland, which is the thymus, and then one duct, which is the thoracic duct. Moving on to the anterior mediastinum, you've got the thymus gland, lymph nodes and fat tissue. Okay, moving on to the middle, so you've got the heart, you've got the pericardium, you've got the trachea, the bronchi, you've got lymph nodes. Now we'll go to the vans, you've got five vans. The artery is the ascending aorta, the pulmonary artery, the vein is the superior vena cava, and the pulmonary vein, the nerve is the phrenic nerve. For the posterior, you have four bands. You've got the descending aorta, then you've got the azygous vein and the hemiazygous vein. Then you've got one nerve, which is the vagus nerve. Along with that, you've got the esophagus and the thoracic duct. An easy way to remember the contents of the posterior mediastinum is to remember dates. So D is for the descending aorta. A is for the azygous and the hemiazygous veins, T is for the thoracic duct, E is for esophagus, and S is for the sympathetic ganglion. Okay guys, that is it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.